what is social IP? I like to define it and go back to Oxford, England for a moment. Oxford's where the enterprise is. It's where I live. And, you know, basically my job is to commercialize this technology along with wonderful people so we can fund the effort in Rwanda that James Chen has done wonderfully. That's my job. I've been doing it for 30 years in office furniture, nanotechnology, color calibration, and there's one thing I learned. Social IP works. It's actionable. And it works every day if you know how to do it. What is it? Want me to tell you? All right. I'm going to try now. So hold on to your suit. Let's hold on to yourself and button your seat belts. I'm going to talk about the secret sauce, social IP. By the way, I think social IP is, you know, game seven of the World Series, the NBA Finals. I think it's really Nadal at the U.S. Open. It's the whole ball game, regardless of the business. It's made up of four components. That's my vision of a company. Leadership, talent, execution, and culture. So I'll talk a little bit about those pieces. That's how I vision a company. First of all, leadership. You've got to pick leaders who run the business. Young men and women who are really the first piece of a business. They run it as the leadership team. They trust each other. They work as a team. They have an enterprise view. And they look upon the business as the owner does. That's leadership. That's the first effort in social IP. The second is talent. You've got to attract people with the degrees and talent and passion that can run a business. If they're not skilled, you really can't win. Third piece really is culture. The culture of the company, the DNA, how people think about themselves, the personality of a company. You establish you know, large, audacious goals. You allow people to fail. You create an atmosphere, essentially, to people. It's the best job they ever had. You define the culture and how you really treat each other is how you'll treat the customers. Culture is the ball game. Culture also says if there's problems, you really call them areas to be managed or speed bumps. You nurture the culture by humor and food. <laughs> and you're, you live there. I live in Oxford. I'm a kid from Boston, but I live in Oxford. Even though I was with that guy 3,000 years ago. All right? I live in Oxford because I'm with the culture. And finally, the last piece of social IP, as I see it, the last piece is execution. I believe that if you execute, if there's no win, row, essentially you focus on a company and you execute. You don't worry that much about competition, regulation, economics, you worry about the controllables, and you get everyone rolling at the same pace with excellence and passion. That's social IP. Social IP, it's actionable. It builds businesses. It's a world-changing idea. Thank you very much.